Assalamu alaikum students. This lecture is for the class fifth, the second lecture of the uh, unit called The World of Growing Knowledge. In the first lecture um, that we discussed about how the introduction of the printing, printing, how the printing started, how the evolution of books started, how people get attracted because of the paper, because of the books, because of the growing uh, knowledge of the books, people get more and more interested in the literature, in the, and that leads that literature, that the people get the knowledge from the books, and those books help in the making the people literate, and those literate people can make a good progress in a country. So today we will discuss about Braille. A script for the blind. We are blessed that we can read books with the help of our eyes. Braille, that means a script which is for the blind people. A blind person cannot see with his or her eyes, but there is some a script called Braille which a blind person can sense and can learn. So we are blessed that we can read books, but in the world, Everyone is not fortune. Sometimes some people are in this world are blind. So for them there is Braille, a script for them. Script means that those uh, printing which can we read, through which we can learn. So we are blessed that we can read books with the help of our eyes. However, a blind person can not. A special script called Braille enables a blind person to read a book. It was developed by Louis Braille of France, who himself was blind. That means Braille is a script which is uh, which was developed by a blind person called Louis Braille of France for the persons, for the people who are blind, who cannot read book it is a special script what that is braille which is for the blind people made by a blind person called lewis braille in braille the letters are printed in some pattern of small dots which are raised from the surface of the paper the blind person feels it with the touch of his or her fingers that means braille is the name of that french person and the script is also called a braille. So the, in the braille, the letters are printed there. And the pattern of small dots which are raised from the surface of the paper. The blind person can feel them through their fingers. The blind person feels it with the touch of his or her fingers. Braille is read by lightly running the fingers along these dots. Such books have proved beneficial in educating the blind. That means this braille is a script which is made by small dots. And when a blind person lightly run, runs them or feels them with their fingers. And also these books have contributed a lot in educating the blind person. This was about the braille a script for the blind persons but we can say that the human beings are the most intelligent creature on this earth if there is a script for the blind those are also human beings but the creativity of man is given by the god so we can say human beings are the most intelligent creature on this earth have also tried to gather more and more knowledge as we can say that human beings among all the <coughs> living organisms are very intelligent and they always try to gain more and more knowledge their story of knowledge goes on increasing and they they want to know more and more knowledge and that knowledge goes increasing and increasing nature has blessed them with the power to understand and improve upon their communication skills by their efforts they give their knowledge and gradually made in an enormous power so we can say that nature the god has given us the power 
to understand and improve our communication skills communication skills means listening speaking reading writing these are the communication skills through which we can l- listen read speak write and these are given by god these are given by nature to human beings by their efforts they grew their knowledge and gradually made an enormous power so we can say that through these communication skills we humans gain more and more knowledge people started inventing several things which were the foundation of the modern invention of fire wheel alphabet clocks farming etc so we can say that through knowledge through gaining knowledge through reading more and more books the people have led to many inventions that means people the human beings have invented many things like fire like wheel like alphabet cloths farming etc more and more things are there the list is still incomplete the human race is growing its knowledge even today with many modern techniques so we can say that human beings have increased their invention level more and more not only are these but there is more and more invention more and more invention of different things like engine steam engine is there aeroplane is there helicopter is there railways are there the different infrastructure designs are there buildings are there these are all the human creations but this human creation is given by god and there are our sources like reading books and printing different books are there to gain more and more knowledge now if we look at the story of writing how the story writing starts with the human beings the story of writing begin when the early human tried to record their inventions for the sake of future generations they started making sounds actions and invented symbols to represent each sound they started drawing several pictures in the caves to express their thoughts so we can say that if there is creativity if there is any invention if there is anything else these are human creations but human creations have given this power by the almighty allah by the nature so if we look at the story of writing how writing has begun it has begun very early and the people at early times record their inventions for the sake of future generations it means when they start writing or when they use the animal uh, skin or feather uh, feathers or bird feathers or extra different things for writing they record them they keep them for the future generation so that the future generation can also see them they start making sounds they start communicating with each other make different sounds make different actions and invented symbols to represent each sound that means if we can say a a has a sound a that means at the early times they make different symbols and those symbols were given different sounds so that they can understand to each other they start drawing several pictures in the caves to express their thoughts as students you know that we write on our letters on our books notebooks on our diaries if we have any thought in our mind we write down them at early times the people at they were live, living in the caves different caves they draw pictures there so that if they have anything in their mind they can draw them they were the pictures were drawn on the walls on the floor on the mud so that they can express their different thoughts you can see in these pictures these are the early cave paintings early cave paintings there they they show us that if they have anything in mind they draw their pictures on the walls so all in all this topic will continue in next lecture but we can say that 
the invention of writing the braille and the human creation is evolving and this world of growing knowledge becomes more and more interesting and more and more get us evolved with the different inventions with the different knowledge thank you